what to wear. Remember, layers, layers, layers. Quite often what happens is people are so warm when they go ashore on a shore excursion, they've got too much gear on, it's easy to shed. But if you're then going on a Zodiac cruise, quite often they can be colder so that's where it's good to have those layers. That thermal base layer is so important. And even on the ship, for example, on the sea passage, I often have my base layer on underneath my other um, clothing in case something of interest appears outside and we have to dash out on deck and I'm still a warm. One thing I should say with some good clothing is uh, be wary of the washing on board it's often very hot water it can and it can shrink things so do be wary of not putting your your best t-shirt in the wash or you may want to use your own um your own powders to wash your own sensitive clothes the other thing is of course is keeping warm these these sort of uh, scarves are amazing for keeping warm you can wrap them up around your ears on the zodiac and then you can pour them down when you feel warmer you may want a woolen hat or you may want a peaked cap. And what's very important, sunglasses. Sometimes people forget sunglasses. That's so important. You then have gloves. Everyone realize about bringing gloves. They can get wa watery and wet and salty. You may want to bear, bring a second pair while the other one is drying out. And do think of a thin pair. These are great for wearing underneath the other gloves on a Zodiac cruise but what's very important about these thinner pairs is when you're on board you're going to spend a lot of time going out on deck. It's a great way to keep your hands warm but still being able to um, alter your camera settings. Then finally to get really waterproof remember those waterproof trousers and I recommend the ones where you can zip up. It's much easier to put over those rubber boots. And most of the cruise ships will provide you with rubber boots so you don't need uh, walking boots. Even in the Arctic where you may go on walks, we often prefer you to wear the rubber boots in case a polar bear turns up. And obviously you can't rush back to get your, get, get your rubber boots on for the Zodiac. And finally, there's your really warm jacket you may choose to bring but it's a lot of weight so do check a lot more cruise operators provide you with a jacket you can take away which has their um, emblem on it as a sort of advertisement. 